Hi, Coach Krause here. Today we're going to play an activity called Carnival Throw. To set up Carnival Throw, you'll need a few things. First, you need an ironing board. Then, you need a laundry basket turned upside down. A little cardboard box on top of the laundry basket. And then also you'll need some plastic or paper cups. And I've set up my plastic and paper cups all over in different heights around this area. Let's look at another picture so you can see what it looks like from a different angle. So now that you can see what it looks like, let's talk about how to do this activity. To do this activity, you're going to need five sock balls. So I got my sock balls here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to practice my overhand throwing. So I've got one sock ball here. Remember when we do our overhand throwing, we're going to step towards our target. We're going to reach back, make our, make our T. So I'm reaching back, making my T, bringing the ball over my ear, and rotate, twist my hips. I'm twisting my hips as I throw. So we're going to do that, and we're going to use our five sock balls, and we're going to try to knock down as many cups as we can. Let's see what it looks like. So I step, reach out, twist my hips. Woo! I got a cup. Let's use another one. Step. I'm going to reach out, twist my hips. I got another cup. I'm going to keep on throwing until all my sock balls are gone. Oh, I missed that time. I don't get anything. Let's try again. Reach, step. Oh, I missed again. Oh, no. Oh, I have one more sock ball left. I'm gonna, I hope I can hit something this time. Oh, I got one. So after you've thrown all your sock balls, you're going to count how many cups you've knocked down. You get one point for every cup that you knock down. Then you're going to write down your points and set up your target area again. So I'm going to set up my target area again. I'm putting my cups back. And as soon as I get everything set up, I am going to play again. I'll get my five sock balls and I'll throw again and I'll see if I can beat my record. You can play with a partner, someone in your family at your house that wants to play and you guys can just take turns, or you can play just by yourself. Remember, when you throw, if you are closer to the target, it's going to be easier, and if you're further away, it's going to be harder. So make sure that you pick a distance that's good for you. Have fun throwing!